Hello guys, this is our second video on how to learn Python programming in Dixieland Power Factory and create a data exchange between Python and Dixieland. In this short video, we will have a quick overview of the required libraries for both Dixieland and Python programming language. And at the end of video, we will also learn how to install those required libraries or Python package. To create data exchange between Python and Dixieland software, we need to have some basic libraries such as Dixieland Power Factory libraries, NumPy, CPy, OpenPy Excel, and Matplotlib libraries in Python. There are also some more required libraries, but we will not use them directly, so no need to mention here now. It should be noted that the advantage of using Python over Dixieland is that in Python you can use of any libraries for analyzing of a power system. The first library that I mentioned was Power Factory library. This library is created specifically for the integrated of Dixieland software with Python and other programs to execute commands in Dixieland environment. And the function of this library corresponds to the function in DPL language. Some of the function in DPL can be written in the Python in the same way, like the get branch command, uh, which is written similarly both for DPL and Python. Some of them perform the same task except a few change in the name, like printf and print plane that are used for printing the character, string, float, integer, octal, and hexadecimal values onto the output screen. Some of the other functions allocated only for Python program, like set attribute, and it is not existed in DPL. The next library that we use the most is NumPy that is used to perform a large variety of mathematical operations and it adds a strong data structures to Python that guarantee efficient calculations with arrays and matrices and provides an extensive library of high-level mathematical functions and we will not go further in details in this tutorial. The next library that we will use is OpenPyExcel it is again a Python library uh, which is used for reading and writing Excel with different extension. And in this tutorial, we will use it to modify and save the data and results obtained from a network system in the Exiling Power Factory as Excel file. And the next library that we will use directly is matplotlib which is a plotting library for the Python programming language. And in this tutorial, we will use it for drawing of various diagram of electrical system. Now let us look at the way how to install them. In a new version of Python, this command pip install package name can be easily used to install libraries. For example, when you want to install NumPy, just write pip install numpy on your common window and then press enter. After a few seconds, the package will start installing. But before that, it should be noted that the Python must be recognized as internal or external command in CMD. To check that, just type Python, click enter. If no error appears, and you see something like this, the version of your Python, means that your Python is recognized. Then you can install the package by writing pip install and your Python package. For example, if you want to install matplotlib, uh, write here it is name. Then press enter. And after a few seconds, you will notice that the package will be installed. That is all for this video. And in the next video, we will talk about 
the widely used functions of libraries. So see you in the next video.